He will stop, swing it around to Soto's right side. He'll pull up for a jump shot, and that's nothing but net. And Meeks will clear the boards for Bucknell. Give it to Soto's. So he'll dribble his way in the front court. Go for a reverse layup. Up and good. Nice seal block by Moore. Now Soto's takes his man inside. Gets caught. Forces up a jump shot. And it goes around the rim and in. Tough shot for Jimmy Soto's, but he has scored the last six. Ellis will give it left wing to Meeks. Hand it off to Walter. He'll fake the three. Pull up for a 15-footer. And bank it in. Walter Ellis doesn't normally like the mid-range shots. Bison down four, your spear for a three. Bingo! Khalil Spear hits Buckdell's first trade. Now with the shot clock under 10, here's Funk off a high screen for a contested three. Bingo! Funk is fantastic. They have definitely put up a bunch of them here in the first half. Here's a three by Toomer. Bingo! Turning shot from 24 or more feet that time by Avi. Been tied a couple of times here in this first half. Now Spear just forces his way in for a tough baseline layup against Schwieger. Tumor gets the inbound, splits defenders, goes up for a shot. Good! And he was fouled! Oh, my almighty! Tough take that time, and I think Llewellyn just got whistled for his second in about the last four seconds. Tumor will give it out to Vander Heiden, push it over to Soto's left side. Six to shoot, shoot a long three, bingo! Oh, baby! Soto says certainly showed up. Nine to shoot for Bucknell. The Bison will inbound to the right of the glass. They'll do so to Toomer for a corner three, bingo! And for the first time today, the Bison lead on Avi's three. Timeout for the Princeton Tigers. Over to Moore, Moore, one-on-one -on -one with Ari Guzzo, goes for a fading 10-footer, and Bruce is on the board as he has his first two today. Tigers with the ball down a point and here comes a steal! Toomer will steal it. Here's Soto's the other way. Draws contact. Throws it up. Good! And he was up. Oh, you L-E-D. That spells foul! Oh, my almighty! Back-to-back -back steals. This one produces points. Soto's was actually the first guy who got a hand on it. Toomer completed the steal. Toomer with it. Off a handoff from Meeks, looks for Meeks, who's posted up, flip it to him right baseline. He's going to go with a quick left hand shot up and good. And does anybody not know that he's a lefty? Sotos near midcourt, dribbling between his legs, comes off a high screen by Meeks. He'll give it back for a Meeks three. Bingo! John Meeks, it's good to have you back, big guy. But then we'll start Meeks this half, and he'll go with a nifty reverse layup. Pulls the Tigers within three. Funk with a tough mid range shot. Good! And he was fouled up. Toomer with the top of the key, led the Bison in scoring at the half, draws a double, gives out for a tough three by Funk. Bingo! Wow! What a tough shot on the right wing. Sotos rejects the screen by Moore, goes baseline, just pushes off as he'll kiss one off the glass up and good. Jimmy's first point to the second half. Bison down by a Baker's dozen. Funk will give it to Moore right baseline. He's been really quiet today against Ariguza with three fouls. He'll back him down. Nice up and under that time by Moore. That was something that Jonathan Brown, assistant coach, had been working with Moore after practice yesterday. To Funk, left wing. Switched on by Freiburg. He's going to take him on the drive. Great screen by Moore. That allows Funk to go all the way to the glass on the left-hand layup. Malachi will hand it off to Funk. Funk looked inside, bounced to Malachi. Now he's going to kick it back out to Funk. He'll drive in the lane, go up for a right-hand layup this time. Funk gets it over the rim for his 14th point. Does so to Llewellyn with 10 on the clock for Princeton. Llewellyn falls down, ball popped free. Here is DeRozier. He has it stolen by Rhodes. He's going to come up and slam it in! First career slam for the Peach State product. And the house erupts here at Soika. Time out, Tigers. 8.23 remaining. And a 17-point lead has been trimmed to four. 70 to 66. We'll take a timeout. Toomer will drive down low against Iwamu and go up for a shot. No good. Malachi Rhodes will get the rebound. Put it up around the rim. No good. Tap up and in by Avi Toomer. Sotos will kick it over to Roberts and fake the three. Try baseline with an off-balance layup and it'll roll in. And Princeton led by 17. Bucknell cut it to four. Couple of different instances, but Princeton able to hit some big jumpers, particularly three-pointers in this contest. It really rode 
Ryan Schwieger, his first action this year to a big victory by 10 points here today, 87 to 77.